What's going on, governors? Chisco here, and today, whoo, pass opening, restart account. I don't know why I'm always yelling when I get on stream. I think I'm actually yelling so loud it's hurting my voice. I gotta chill, man. I have such a high power mic. I don't have to yell. Hope you're all doing well. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna lose my voice just screaming at the start of the scream. Yo. What's up, everybody? Kraken, Ivan, Ramad, Torjor. I don't know how to pronounce your name. We'll go with 8AO. My own little abbreviation there. Zolt, what's up, dude? Xerxes. How's it going, Anthony? Zeus? Andy? Soda Gaming? MacBo? Joe Roo? Sebi? What's up, members and moderators in the chat? I appreciate you. Also, big shout out to my legendary guard whose photos rotate in the wall of my war room. I appreciate y'all. Let's jump in game. We actually do not have much time before this pass opening. Um, and I need to go from my main account where, like, hey, yo, I mean, we've got a hunt for history and, like, two mountain warfares in a short window of time. Every time I open the freaking game, I got another couple of these treasures of purple crystal to claim. Sheesh. I'm going to tell my mom on t I'm on TV. Right on, Anthony. So many goodies. So many goodies. Jeez. Okay. Just when you think you've claimed them all. Is the Nile map a good fighting KVK? Yeah, I like the Nile map. Chat says WTF. But your name is little your name is literally Kraken. So aren't you used to this Kraken? This is just your way of being, isn't it? Who do you think is going to win the KVK? Uh, I mean, I think things are going really well in my main account KVK, and things are going really well in my restart account KVK as well. Let's switch over. Get ready here, chat. The entire stream is just opening chests. Yeah, hey, welcome to the stream. Glad you made it. Thanks for being here. Uh, now we can just shut down the stream. We opened all our gold chests. We're out. That was from the main account, yeah. Now we switch over to the restart account. And we should get ready. I picked up a rune, so that's uh, part of the preparation. What's the buff? No buffs, bro. Bro took my gold and gave me no buffs. Dude, why are there why is there ever a day with no buffs? Why is there ever literally ever a day with no buffs? Asking for a friend. Like what is the reason behind having a day where there are no buffs? Eighteen twenty four in Greenwood caught up. Yeah, dude, y'all freaking clap some cheeks. My God, dude, our allies did some work. But first, let's actually get ready to field fight here, and then we can uh, go and get a look around the map. We got our fifty percent expansion, ten percent defense token. Extra troop capacity. Let's lock it in, baby. Mm. 
Okay. As soon as this march is home, in 43 seconds, we can run out on the field, but is my field geared up? I think the answer is going to be yes. Liucha is good. Boudica is good. Huo is good. Guan Yu is good. Trajan is good. Armaments. Liu Che, chillin' baby. B Prime. Kind of can't believe I don't have a better Archer one, but actually that's pretty good. That one is pretty damn good. Wow, actually. Brisk. Bro, speed of siege. GTFO, man. All right. All right, then. Cavalry. I'm kind of surprised I don't have better over here, too. But <clears throat> apparently I do not. Apparently I do not. Requital. Yeah, I mean... This, yeah, I see why I have the armaments I have. Shielded? That's pretty decent. Ooh, fit? I mean, yeah. All right, well. Ooh, oh, but fine horse, bruh. Fine horse? <clears throat> you gotta be kidding me. All right, then. I think we're ready to run it out on the field. Makes sense why you have Joan with the infantry. Yeah, so Joan is wearing the artifact that makes her infantry. Okay. Fine horse, let's go. Bruh. Just adjust that real quick. Alright. Good. Okay, the map. Wait a minute. Oh, okay. I was like, dude, there's no way I have more levels of this to do, is there? Attila Liu Che rally? Yeah, wedge formation on Liu Che because I don't have good arch armaments yet. I don't have the arch armaments to support it. Tuesday, 17 UTC. See, there I go yelling again, chat. Kingsland, baby. Should I make an upgrade equipment or wait if there are updates? I mean, look, like, actually, I'm going to do an upgrade to some equipment right now, but you really shouldn't. What I'm just going to do, I forgot to deploy an Iconic Crystal, so I'll go do that. I think I have time. Do I have time? Yeah, I mean, I have time. I just want to put an Iconic on this bad boy. Can I do that when he's out? Oh, I can! Uh, okay. Didn't know that would work. Okay, sure. Iconic Crystal deployed. Okay. Go. So. Um, so I have a lot of legendary materials, but I'm kind of waiting to see what the new equipment system becomes on this account. 
Now, with regard to the map, as I said, Kingsland Tuesday. Since you last saw this zone, my god, has a lot happened. We pushed all the way up to here. We were attacking this point, and we were like, bro, this is not a strategic advantage that we're fighting into here. So we, we surrendered this whole side of the map. We gave it for free. And then we rebuilt into this zone and pushed through here. We pushed through this pass, built forts on the other side of the pass. Then we built to this Heron and we took the Heron. And we're like, all right, this is strategic. So the 5% defense was a strategic pickup. Uh, and then we've just been chilling. But our allies really had a lot to do. Now you may remember our allies, they were the only Imperium in the KVK, but they were up against two A Kingdoms. And the two A Kingdoms really bullied uh, the, our allies in the bottom right here. Um, so when this zone opened, our allies really couldn't do much of an entry into it. But then when this pass opened, then the middle camps get involved. And I would say that our middle camp dramatically shifted the power balance in this sort of 2v2. Really, it's like a 4v3, right? Like two zones versus two zones. Four kingdoms versus three kingdoms. We're the three kingdoms. They're the four kingdoms. And they were able to slowly and steadily, I mean, really, like slowly and steadily, they built into the zone, they took this, they pushed over here, they took this, they pushed up to here, they took this, they pushed over here, they took the circle, they pushed to here, and they're on the verge of getting this pass. And then they push up over this way and we'll see how far they get. Now they're up against uh, this circle over here. So we'll see, man. But our, but our allies have been putting in the work. It's been really great to see. I'm not going to lie. It has been really great to see. And so here we are. Pass opening. We've basically been, in, been fighting the same group the entire time. They have slightly more power than we do. They have more kill points than we do. And it's a 1v1. And I feel like we're doing great. I can use a buff here. Bro has 300,000 gems on his restart. True. True. Bro has 300,000 gems on his restart. Hey, yo. 325,000 gems to be exact. Jalax, welcome back to the Honor Guard. Dude, you're about to flip to the two-year crystal shield. Let's freaking go. Let's get those hype emojis for Jalax renewing his membership. Let's go. Who do you think is going to get the pass? Man, I don't know. But I am kind of hyped to see some Gorgo. Like, Gorgo's got to get used, right? I don't actually know what our kingdom's going to do, but they got to use Gorgo, right? They got to, got to use some Gorgo. We need some Gorgo reports. Hey, I mean, it's a pass. Like, if you're not using Gorgo, you're doing it wrong. Uh-oh. Miz, Chess, Chess. Okay, check the Discord PMs. Uh-oh. I'm in trouble. Okay. Okay. Chat, I got in trouble. Not really, actually. It's more a, a warning. I am streaming in live, uh, you know, in real time here. Thanks. Yeah, miss. No worries, bro. Hey, so will BDO leave server thirty-two? Absolutely, man. Absolutely. Um, did you all see BlizzCon yesterday? How many of you saw BlizzCon yesterday? You got in trouble for not riding a fine horse. True.
You were at BlizzCon? Dope. Oh my god. 80% of you didn't see BlizzCon? Do y'all not yet like never played World of Warcraft or Diablo or none of it? No. Oh wow. Okay. Hey yo. Never heard of it? Oh my god. Next question will be do you live under a rock? We just rock nerds? Oh, it, technically you are under a rock. Bad joke. That is a bad joke. Very punny. Bad jokes. Hey. Neil, you free to play peasants. Okay, peasant. let's move my soundboard within arm's reach here. Overwatch, bro? Oh yeah, I like forgot about Overwatch. You know, the game where they made a 2.0 because they were going to make a PvE campaign and then like a year in decided not to make a PvE campaign? that overwatch joking aside i do generally really like blizzard games specifically i mean i i logged a lot of hours in diablo and world of warcraft obviously crazy amar thank you for the super chat Woo, we got the pass let's go they're swarming the pass oh sheesh hey yo they're swarming the pass well, they're really, they're really going for it. Swarm the swarmers. Swarm the swarmers! Oh god, I need dot mode. Dot mode engaged! Beep boop! Hey, yo, can we get a garrison in that pass? OMFG, bro. We need garrison up in here. Uh-oh, I'm gonna die. It is what it is, baby. Hey, yo, please attack somebody, actually. Do I have to do this thing again? Maybe. Oh, God. The thing about this time of day that typically they have a bigger field than we do so that's awkward all right chat we're off to a good start i did my part i did my part <laughs> jeez uh, it was great right up until it wasn't chat oh yeah no these reports do we look at these reports or do we just say hey it's just is what it is you just had, you know, you had to do what you had to do to get it set up. You know, we got to get the garrison into the pass. Just is what it is. I mean, some positive, some negative. It's fine. I'll, I'll make it, chat. I'll survive. You got to do what you got to do. We had to run out there. Save the pass. I contributed. Ooh, Gorgo Hera. Not my first choice. Not my second choice. Not my third choice. Not my fourth choice. But maybe my fifth choice. Crazy Amar, go, 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 2293. Let's go. Oh, we're holding the pass. Part of the reason we had to run out in front of that thing is to give the garrison captain an opportunity to get in there. They're in there, all right. What would be my first choice? Well, you got to be good against a rally, so... Either Gorgo Constantine or Xeno Gorgo is the way. Why are you dunking on Mori like that? I'm not dunking on Mori. Hey, if we're talking about what human is in the garrison, Mori is my first choice for what human to put in the garrison. Okay. All right. But since we're talking about commanders, not players... <laughs> I would say that uh, you want something that's extremely good, single target. I think the value of the Hera is like, maybe I can just kill my siege units, question mark. 
just end with a 20 gifted. Yo, let's get those hype emojis. For the most generous whale in Rise of Kingdoms. Also the strongest player by power. Yo boy, Justin, a.k.a. Yoda808. Let's freaking go. So strong, they even named a commander after him. They actually named the commander after him. A.K.A. Justinian. Well, let's go. That's right. We got the patented Yoda 808 emoji here. Technically, actually, it's not patented. That's an image that Yoda sent me ages ago. <laughs> HS Quo, well, my best commander is Ethel Prime. Minamoto second to attack people. Is that good? Well, we all gotta start somewhere. The real question is where is the rally on this pass, TBH? Yoda Wow. Actually, technically, it's Yoda 808. So just replace the W's with 8's and you're good. <laughs> what a nerd, Dad. Oh, my God. What a freaking nerd. I'm talking about myself. Ayo. I mean, I literally put my face on Pakal's body. Like, what do you expect? Hey, the rally's here. How's the KVK going? Great. The rally and Gorgo with a Tata given Zia. That can't be good. Except that we're using Hera, so it could actually be very good. Z4502. I feel like I'm I'm calling out a droid in Star Wars terms. Z45, welcome to the Elite Guard. Yo, let's get this hype emojis for Z45. Newest member of the Elite Guard. Let's freaking go. Big Poggers. I feel like I need to switch gears here and like swap off of my field marches and toward just raining at this point. This, what's up, dude? I'm going to stand at the regroup ball marker for now. Ooh, they canceled. Gorgo looking really strong. Hey, yo, Gorgo slaps. Gorgo freaking slaps. Report? Question mark? Smiley face? Emoji guy. Dropping those hype emojis. Let's go. The garrison looks strong, though. Yeah, no, Mori's not fooling around. Let's get this dub, bro, says Santos. Oh my gosh, that Caesar animated is crazy. Hiya. Gorgo Constantine? Hey, I would put Gorgo Constantine in that garrison, baby. I would do it. But I think Mori is trying to offer us the ability to kill off other troop types, which actually is probably really smart. So... Yeah, I mean, it's fine. Is Salad and CC a viable option in KVK2? Yeah, that works in KVK2. That works in KVK2. Um I think the issue here is we probably don't want to kill off exclusively infantry. That's the issue I would guess. 
Chat, our top secret push time is 17.27. Top secret. Top secret, chat. It is the top secret push time. <laughs> They'll never see it coming. They'll never expect it. We're going to catch them by surprise. <laughs> God, Chiz School ruins everything. Yeah, see, they're even like, they're like, Joan of Arc, thanks for letting us know. Thanks for the heads up, Cheese Ghoul. Oh, uh, yeah, and this guy's back at it with the Cleo face palm. Yep, yeah, Martel. All right, what do I have, man? I feel like I haven't actually invested any time in some cool emojis. I should do that. All my emojis are static. I'm such a noob. Um, I don't know. Can I do anything about that right now? I could work on Lohar, I guess. Do I get anything for all that? I've got a good head on my shoulders. All I get is a compliment. All that for a comp... Oh, God, no, I'm stuck in, in this crap. No. Nope. 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 I'll do it later. Our top secret push time's coming up. I gotta be ready for it. Level six for the emojis. I don't even get the emoji. Seven for the emojis. Bro. I feel like maybe they're setting up for a double. Let's go check their Koa real quick. Are they actually setting up for a double? It doesn't show me coalition options. Maybe they're not in one. They're in ORB coalition. And these guys, yeah, they have no coalition. It literally says none. Yeah, so they're setting up for a double. First Demagi is on seven and then 10. Got it. All right, time to send the old troops to Valhalla. I feel like, although the marker says to go right, I'm pretty sure these guys on the left are not in Koa. So, like, I could probably clear out the left and end their ability to double right now. Which is what I'm inclined to do. Just literally end their, their second rally's ability to do anything. All right, chat. We shove to the left. All right, now that we cleared that out, we shove to the right. 
Dude, I feel like I'm giving directions for the electric slide. Slide to the left. Slide to the right. What's the next instruction? Isn't it like a double time call out or something? Or maybe a two times call out? Two times, two times. All right, whatever. It's been like a hundred thousand years since I've been to a wedding or a bar or bat mitzvah where you're doing the electric slide. I don't know. What are other occasions for an electric slide? What, what is the occasion upon which we slide electrically? Crisscross. There it is. Yeah, crisscross. That's it. Hey, yo. There we go. All my dance moves I learned from DJs. Oh, God. Okay, what's the um, dance move that's recently been popping off, though? There's a new dance move. It's actually not new. It's just been popping off. What's it called? I can't remember the name of it. I actually should know it. I can't remember the name. Help me out, chat. New dance move. Popping off recently. Slick back. That's it. Yeah, I knew it. I'm like, oh, this is going to be dumb. I'm going to, of course, know it the second I hear it. Yeah, slick back. Bro, the juvie slide. Yeah. Slick back. It's friggin' twerking. Okay, take it easy, chat. Good God. Take it freaking easy. No, slick back's crazy. Can you do the Juby slide? No, I haven't ever tried. That does seem like a really good thing to know how to do, though. I'm going to be real with you. Like, that seems like a great thing to learn how to do. I should 100% learn how to Juby slide. Chats is you invented twerking? Yeah, okay. And and just like they, they shared in the Austin Powers movie, I invented the question mark. You watching the Juby slide on TikTok? No. YouTube shorts, really? No, but like Juby slide looks cool, man. It looks like they're freaking floating in the air. That's nuts. I need to learn how to do that. It's like the closest thing you can get to flying. It's crazy. I guess hovering is more what I mean than flying. Oh, dude, these guys are all over my marches. Holy. I think my hospital will be fine, right, chat? I'm not going to get dead troops, am I? I'm not getting dead troops from fielding, am I? No shot, right? Yeah, I'll be okay. I'll be fine. Oh, God, I'm tanking. Okay. Uh, I mean... Guess I can refresh. I'm actually just going to ambush this guy. Technically, he should ambush me. Boom! 20k from Boudica? Woo! Oh, here comes Liu Chet. Get him. Slow. Get him with the slow. Get him with the slow. Liu Chet. Oh, left combat. Tragic. This is why you should always get a march speed rune, folks. This is why I was so sad when he said the cha-cha slide. Guy died. <laughs> uh, I'm just killing my chat. 
where the relevant dance is. One hundred sixty gold heads. Should I take E Song to five five one one? Um, what is it like? Ten, ten, fifteen, fifteen. Then isn't it like? I don't know. Wasn't there like twenty? I forget the exact number of sculptures. You need three hundred and twenty. No, you need three hundred and twenty to get to like five 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 one. Actually, it's more like 390, right? 180 gold heads for 5511, chat says. Okay, there you go. I knew chat would have my back on this one. I knew chat would have my back. Dude, pen 15 getting kicked from the Alliance. Not sure if you saw that. Very creative. Look at the reports. Why the city skin? Yo, the city skin is goaded. I gain infantry health and I lose archer attack. We're chilling, baby. Rip healing speed ups? Oh, bro. <laughs> yeah, sure. Rip healing speeds, but look at this report. 46 to 201. 30 to 260. 20 to 120? Yo, people hate on that Trajan, but... He's okay. 31 to 236? 91 to 167. Guess those reports are okay. Boys are going hard today, chat says. <laughs> uh, ooh, rewards. Woohoo! Materials, materials. Ayo, armaments. Let's go check them out. Arch. Nobody cares, they're blue. Wedge. Nobody cares, they're purple. All right, well, is what it is. Who always missing AoE? That is true. He is missing AoE. But unfortunately with Huo Joan, you overrage. Oh, fall back. What the heck happened? This is why I'm not allowed to leave the front line, chat. Look what happened in my absence. Without my combat leadership. The front line evaporated. What really happened, in case you're wondering, is that, much like an Ark of Osiris, how one team refreshes and come back stronger, right? Like, we couldn't refresh, they could refresh, they take over the field. That's how that goes. Chiskel carrying us for real, for real? I mean, not really, right? Like, that's just a funny thing to say because I'm live streaming more than anything else. Speaking of which, hey, if you are enjoying the live stream, do me the honor of throwing a like on here. Consider subscribing. Look in Alliance chat. Holy. Yo, those are some reports. Okay, 1k watching, yikes. Yeah, that's pretty dope, man. We got a thousand people. Hey, if you were to ask me 10 years ago, hey, Chiskul, would you believe me? Would you believe me if I told you that 10 years from now, you'd be playing a mobile game with dots where you mostly just look at dots and that you would have over a thousand people watching you, I'd have said, 
first of all, there's no way in hell I'm going to be playing a game where the whole point is to look at dots. So don't even talk to me. And I'd say second of all, 10 years, I would have said 10 years from now, our graphics will be so sophisticated. There's no way I would be playing a game that just involves dots. Get the hell out of my face. Okay. I don't know what drugs you're on, but get the hell out of here. Then second of all, I'd say there's no way, ain't no way there's going to be a thousand people watching me do it. All right. <laughs> Oh, no. What's the first game I started streaming? It is actually Rise of Kingdoms. There aren't dots. They're more like rhombuses. True. All right. Fair enough. More like... I guess they're more like diamonds. Stonelax says, but here we are. I mean, I will say this. I was, back in the day, I was very good at World of Warcraft. I actually was very, very, very good. I should have taken competing and, like, really pushing the limits way more seriously. I was very good. I was a really, really, really good warrior. Especially back in vanilla. Ooh. In vanilla? Hey, yo. That's when I was really good. Esports wasn't a thing for us old farts, says Reaper of Doom. I mean... I was playing with, with a guy who wanted to start a team. And he wanted me to be the warrior on the team. But I forget what he ended up doing. I actually forget the guy's name. Which is kind of unfortunate. Alright, here we go. This is kind of an aggressive move on our part. Like, they don't actually have that many people here. I'm going to rage transfer now. And help my friendos on the right. Dude, if they all go back behind the pass, I swear to God. I think that's what they're going to do. I have a bad feeling about this. I got a feeling we getting stranded out here. Oh, good. The markers is clear them. I don't have to freak out now. I am really exposed attacking from this vector, but I really like this attack vector. Like I said, I'm pretty exposed when I attack this way, though. It's way easier to attack from a vector where, like, I can retreat into the safety of the ball rather than I'm forcing them to look at a flank, basically, and I'm the only guy there. Makes I mean, especially as a content creator, it makes me, like, a really obvious target. But I kind of stopped caring about that long ago. I don't know, for a really long time, like a really, really, really long time, I cared a lot about trades. Like a lot. And I still obviously do care about trades, but like... I don't know, man. These days, I more just care about, like, where does the field need to be? And, like, where is the field now? And, like, what do I need to do to help put the field where it's supposed to be? Does that make any sense, chat? Or am I just a rambling old dude?
Uh oh. Trajan Skippy is a cool pair. So the reason I like Trajan Skippy is that you can trade decently with it. Uh oh. You can trade decently with it. He says while getting into a bad position where he'll trade poorly. Um, oh god, my Guan is yeah, that's dead. Where, dude? The marker says push through, but like, what are people even doing over here? Look, look we got like fifty people chasing one march. But like, if all those people actually push to the right right now, like, this field would be completely ours. Ooh, rally's coming through. That is not a good rally to run. IMO. Yeah, I think they canceled. I don't see the rally marker anymore. I'm pretty sure my Huo is going to die now. Yep, it's dead. Hey, so chat, I have a funny story. You want to hear a funny story? I mean, I guess it's not that funny. I don't know. Now I kind of teased it. So. My wife and I, when the interest rates were really insane, bought a house. And like, little did we know that when we bought a house at like an interest rate of 2.75, it basically meant that we would never buy another house ever again because that interest rate is so good. It's actually just like mental. It's totally insane how good that interest rate is. So our best friends sent us, sent us a message. They're like, hey, there's a house across the street from us. You want to buy it? And we were like, all right, we'll go check it out. Because living across the street from your friends is basically like the dream, right? But bro, interest rates right now are like 8%. No shot. It's crazy. We looked into it though. It just like, it does not work. 8% is just mental. Depends on the friend. Okay, fair enough. What? Wait, what is this Trajan combo? Oh, what? Bro, what the hell? It showed Trajan Nevsky. What was that crap? 49 to 224. Hey, yo. 71 to 178. 66 to 91. 66 to 93. Yo, these trades are not bad. These trades are not bad. You are ranked really highly in M enemy elimination. Really? Why? Like, I'm, I'm like, not free to play over here, but like, I'm not a whale. I'm not a whale. 12? Dude, how about that? I'm not even teleported near the front. I got like a five minute round trip just to get back into the fight. Guan plus Joan, not good. Uh, My Guan, Joan died early. That's what that is. The first march to die was my Boudicca Zuge. The second march to die was my Guan, Joan. And then these marches lived a really long time, which is why they traded so well. Your tech is still not maxed here. Dude, I'm not VIP 18 on this account. Like... I am not, I am, if you're not VIP 18, you're not a whale. I don't know. Why Guan Zhen? Because my cavalry are really good and I'm in a KVK where you can get an artifact that trades one troop type to another. 
So everywhere Joan says she's a cavalry commander, now she says she's an infantry commander due to this artifact in this KVK. So Joan is is actually infantry here. Uh, but you know what we could do just for funsies? I, I'm actually kind of interested. Let's just try this out. Let's just mix it up. I've ran it one way all KVK long. Let's just run it the other way. Just for funsies. Let's just see what happens. We just switch this up real quick, chat. Juan Nevsky? Hey, that's gotta get some good trades, right? Man, they need to release VIP faster. Stacking up VIP points is getting boring. Oh, bro. Do you know how much VIP I have on my main account? I have so much VIP on the main, it's really crazy. Use the relic with Mina? Oh, I haven't maxed the Mina. Am I max tech? I'm not max tech. I have the most tech I could have without having to go spend a bunch on siege stuff again. I'm gonna have to go do this siege tech in order to get this. I guess I could work toward another march, but I'd rather kind of get it through here. Guan Yu plus Nevsky? No, that's not Glass Cannon at all. Guan Yu with Joan was Glass Cannon. That is Glass Cannon. It only has 10 health from the Joan. That's it. Nah, I'm not going to heal the hospital. Your main account? Oh, I have millions of VIP just sitting there from all the bundles I buy. Millions of VIP. They may try to cut off people's escape here. So we'll group up and then like decide what to do. So not only does Nevsky have defensive stats, but Nevsky also has triggered health when he gets attacked. So why not Skippy Liucha? Well, then what am I going to pair with Trajan? Ethel? Gross. I'd rather have Skippy than Ethel. These guys are going to start attacking the line soon, so my job is probably just to defend this line. I mean, maybe. I don't know. Maybe I'll just go to the right and call it a day. Technically, there's two kingdoms that are here, but because our allies won the right side, or at least are winning the right side, that means that... It's, this is probably still just a 1v1. Like, they can't afford to commit to this side with two kingdoms.
dude, it is so laggy. Oh my god. Like, that's not stream lag. Got a dot mode here. All right, I'm going to clear through the pass real quick. This area needs a little love. I'm actually not sure why I'm getting reinforced. That's kind of curious. Oh man, this guy got hit with a slow. Woo! Alright, let's go to the ball. We got this under control now. Here comes the rally. Honestly, I need to kill my troops. Like, I really need to kill troops. But first, I'm going to dive headlong into that ball and see how we do. I see a lot of sad faces for our team here, so I got to get into this. First thing that happens is my Huo goes deep. What the hell? Well, you know how Huo does, man. My bro goes for it, if you know what I mean. We burned the fort. Let's go. Dude, all my marches just got sad faced all at once. That can't be good. Hospital is pretty full. Fall back? Okay. I feel like this is the sort of thing I would have heard if I was in voice, but didn't hear because I wasn't. Well, let's heal the hospital and see how that worked out. Oh, yeah, resources. That's going to be a thing. Let's go solve this resource problem. Dude, I was doing great right up until I was just full dead with all my marches. 18 to 141, 68 to 135. 73 to 79, 73 to 158. Not bad considering that my Huo Joan was basically suicidal. 66 to 137. Cool. Okay. Very good. Very good. Very good. Helps are in. All right. What was it going to do? I feel like it was going to do something. But I don't remember what it was. Woo -hoo -hoo! Remember when I said don't use Gorgo Hera? Y'all remember that? Oh yeah, fix resources, thank you. 
Yeah, this is why you don't use Gorgo Hera. This is why you don't use Gorgo Hera. In case you were wondering. That's it. There's the reason. That that's why. Gorgo sucks with all the recent commanders. Uh, let's fix the resources, man. That's pretty good. Let's just fix this resource problem real quick. All right, chat, we're good now. For like another hour, maybe. <laughs> but really. But actually, and just like that, you're rich again, chat says. You know, I've always been rich in spirit, though. So, poor on resources, but rich in spirit. So really, I've been rich the whole time. You're only a little below Luna in enemy elimination. And she has like 50 billion kill points. Yeah? Is that so? How the heck am I seven? I'm like a free to play. Oh my god. How? I'm not actually free to play. Just to be like really clear. Yeah, <laughs> sure, bud. That's what I tell my wife. I'm free to play in these games. <laughs> nah, she knows I'm a maniac. That's a lie. Almost 400k capacity. Lol, lol, lol. Neil, you free to play peasants. <laughs> free to pay. Need more Gargo reports? Well, we need more stuff to rally then, I guess. Here's the Prof Rock report. Oh! Henry Gilga. Oh! Yikes! Zeno Hera. 36,000 hours of speed ups free to play. Uh. Guan Yu talents? I don't know. Actually, we should check those talents. Are they bad? Let's go find out. Every now and then, I'm like, wait, why the hell am I still using those talents? No, these are good. These are right. These are correct. Use range mode? Nah. Although, I'm not going to lie. Like, a turret in certain situations here would be pretty legit. Truth be told. The fact that I'm seven in this kill event with like a five minute refresh round trip is insane. I cannot believe I'm getting this many kills. People don't believe me when I'm like, these combos are really good. And then I use those combos and they do really well. And I use that equipment and it does really well. I mean, like, you can't make this up, man. This is actually really good. I'm just doing literally exactly what I said to do. And I'm just using it myself. <laughs> and it turns out it works. <laughs> oh, man. Sad these people don't have Constantine maxed. 
They do have Constantine Max. But in this case, I think Mori is trying to give us a way to kill non-infantry. So I, I think he's trying to give us a way to kill off our siege, maybe? But like, these rallies would get clapped if we were using, I think, like Constantine or... Um, I don't know. Xeno would be really good. The only thing they'd be able to do is rally us with, like, a Gilga. And we would just swarm that. Bro, what are they doing? This is one of those moments where, like, they almost certainly made a swarm call in voice that I was not in voice, so I didn't hear. Yeah, Xeno Gorgo is, like, your best... That's your best pick. Why are they rallying with Henry Main and Gilga secondary? Yeah, so if it was rallying into a Gorga, yeah, into a Gorgo, you'd want Gilga to be the primary. But the anti skill damage was actually really good against the Hera garrison that was there. Gorgo Constantine, haha. You want my TP spot? Nah, I'm good, man. I need the exercise. Thank you, though. Seventy-seven to one twelve. But the power differential is crazy. It's crazy to think about how Constantine is even being talked about again. That's true, actually. That's very true. Did I miss a super chat? Hold up. I don't think I missed a super chat. Pro game, I did miss one. Pro game, thank you for the super chat. I'm a 75 mil. I'm a garrison main from my kingdom. I'm using Gorgo, who's she best with? Okay, so I think that Xeno with Gorgo is the play. And I think your next best option is Gorgo with Constantine. And your next best option, if all you care about is a swarm, is Xena, or sorry, Gorgo with Charles Mar Martel. What is better, Skippy E Song or Pac Man Herald? Dude, I love that autocorrect. Pac Man Herald. Um, neither of those really excites me. I guess Skippy E Song will be better, though. Than the uh, Pac-Man Herald. Pro game. No worries. Thank you for the super chat, dude. My apologies on the delay. I'm using Guan Skippy Prime. Good. And Liu Chess Sargon. Good. Is that lineup okay? Yeah, it's good. Good. Do that. Pac-Man Herald meta. Dude, you, you wouldn't call that the Pac-Man Herald meta. You'd call it the Power Pellet meta. The the Power Pellet meta. Isn't that what those are called? Pac-Man power-ups. I'm getting scouted. Those things he eats to beat the ghosts? Pac 
PacmanWiki.com. Okay. Pac-Man was the inventor of the power-up. Really? It set the formula for power-ups across gaming. Power-ups are items... Okay, I know what a power-up... Jesus, what... They are... Trick pellets, super pellets, shockwave pellets. Bro, I swear to God, it was way more simple when I was a kid. Power pellets. Isn't it just power pellets? The first power-up used by Pac-Man. It turns the ghost blue for a limited time, allowing Pac-Man to eat them. Yeah, okay. Tractor beam attack? Oh, I can't even read the rest of this. What the hell have they done to Pac-Man? What have they done to Pac-Man? Chat says Lamau. Gorgo Martel is also trading well in KVK rallies. Yeah, I think it's trading okay, but it really crushes the swarm. New gen couldn't handle that simplicity. I I'm of the mind that there's an elegance to simplicity. Can we see your March setup? Yeah, I covered it earlier in the stream as well. Everybody be like, Trajan sucks. Trajan sucks. Meanwhile, Chiskul's up here, number seven on the leaderboard, with only five marches. Bro, with five... Five marches. I'm not even fighting right now. I'm seven on the leaderboard, bro. I'm literally just standing around. Yeah, okay. Trajan sucks. You're right. Uh, I'm in a KVK where I can take one troop type and turn them into another. So my Nevsky is actually an infantry commander. Nevsky is actually infantry. Dude, I swear, I really needed to put that on a soundboard. I really did. I, I really did need to put that on a soundboard. Put up a text overlay. Honestly, I'm going to pin a chat. Um, Nevsky is wearing a special artifact that makes him an infantry. Okay. Here we go. We got this. All right, I pinned the chat. How's your Lost Canyon lineup? Uh, probably crap now that I have the uh, accessory on the Nevsky instead of the Joan. I would need to make some changes here. Go like that, I guess. Uh, this guy's gonna win. I need more VIP to win battles like this. Oh, okay. I win. GG noobs. All right. Ooh, the rally's hitting. Hey, yo.
Why is there a picture of a Xeno and a Gorgo? What the hell's happening here? Um. Oh, that rally is dead, dead. Oh, it's a triple rally. It's a triple rally crab rave. Let's go. <laughs> All right, get out those crab claws, you landlubbers. Let's do this thing. I feel like trying to swarm this would be a really bad idea. Was that a counter rally? Tell me that's a counter rally. All right, here we go, crab claws. Crab claws, okay? You haven't done a crab rave in a minute? True. This is the part of the stream where we chill the F out. It's a it's a freaking mobile game. Take it easy. Have some fun, y'all. We chillin'. Hey, it's a it's a Xeno! Oh, it's Xeno Hera, GG. That thing is going to get trounced. The rallies are getting smoked. Yo, I can't believe that Garrison's not getting Xeno Hera. Hey, that is not the way. I think it's just a holdover Garrison while uh, Mori refreshes, maybe? What are you doing, Lamau? It's the Crab Rave. Zoom in a bit. Agnes. Uh oh. That's definitely an Italian. Let's get out of the old translator. Uh, Google Translate. Oh, it's Greek. Is it Greek? Nope. Detect language. Italian. Come to Naples. On April. Oh, Comic-Con, huh? Comic-Con. Hold on, I gotta do stuff. Pretty sure I should be doing stuff here. Oh my god. Come on, game. Okay, it says pull back. Where is Gorgo Constantine? TBH? I'm not sure. I'd, I'd kind of love to see it. I don't know that it's particularly good against a multi-rally. Where's that report? Do you have a video how you killed off your siege and got all those speed ups? Yeah, so here's what you do is you fill your hospital with troops that you want to keep. Then when your hospital's full, you put your siege units into a resource node and you have somebody hit them. It's in coalition chat. Oh, well, somebody shared it here too. Ooh, not bad. 720 to 1.1 mil. Ooh, 98 to 331. Ayo. 376 to 608. You know what's funny is I forgot that, like, Mori basically just uses anti-swarm accessories all the time. So he's got a crit vengeance and a crit greatest greatest glory, and I bet you both of those are on there. 
245 to 164. The Tarek Ibn Ziyad with Zuge was actually doing work. Chit School needs some sleep. That sounds nice. Thank you so much for the super chat and the suggestion to uh, go to Comic-Con in April. I don't know that I will uh, be traveling internationally in April. Sometime in the spring, I think I have a Disney trip planned with family. So I don't know that I get to go on yet another trip. How old are you, Chiskul? I mean, old enough to have had a Super Nintendo as a kid, you know? I played F-Zero when it was a new game as a kid. Those were the days. F-Zero was cool. Golden Axe was cool. Contra was cool. Obviously, you played Mario. Obviously. Super Mario Brothers. F-Zero. Dude, F-Zero is like... Ah, that's a great game. F-Zero was a great game. Super Ghosts and Ghouls was a cool game, but so damn hard. Dude, Super Ghosts and Ghouls, you are going to lose to, in that game. The game will win. I also had some some Star Wars game. I can't remember it. What was the Star Wars game I had for Super Nintendo? Okay. I guess I gotta look at this image search to really figure this out. I think I had Super Empire Strikes Back. I might have had Super Star Wars, but I definitely had the Empire Strikes Back. That game was so hard. I did not have Return of the Jedi. God, Super Star Wars. That was a hard game. That was a difficult game. That was cool, though. Battlefront 2, oh, yeah, that is a whole nother generation of gamer. I did play Star Wars Battlefront 2, but like that game kind of sucked. Like the graphics were cool, the concept was cool, but like kind of like the reality of it somehow wasn't. Does that make any sense? I never played Dark Age of Camelot, though. When you say War Commander, do you mean Wing Commander? Wing Commander I played. This man smack talking BF2? Bro. Star Wars Battlefront 2 kind of sucked. Like, it was cool for a minute. 
But like, I don't know, isn't that the game where you pay to unlock Vader and that whole controversy started? Isn't that the most disliked Reddit post of all time about Star Wars Battlefront 2? Where they're like, we thought that paying for Vader or something was like a big accomplishment. Remember that? There's two different Star Wars Battlefront 2s? Well, now I'm just confused. There's two Battlefront 2s. The loot box one. Yeah, I played the loot box one. I saw the graphics. Dude, I even played with my wife, actually. No cap, she played. Stream on Facebook also. Oh, dude, we're getting triple rallied. I should pay attention, actually. I should actually pay attention. Problem is that I do not have reinforcing marches. I have fighting marches here. That's that's the issue. Dude, we are keeping this thing full, bro. Which one are they swarming? Probably this one on the left. I'm just going to go for it and hope that's what they're doing. Yep, it's dead. They're just going for all of them? They're just going to swarm all of them? I should almost certainly be in voice. Do they even bother swarming the third rally? Like, you just trade positive against that, I would think. Oh, that rally's dead, though. Uh, everybody backed up. I'm just walking in AoE for no reason now. Have I expertise Gorgo on either account? I have not. Dude, I actually think... Get in VC. <laughs> Dude, I'm so busted. I'm so busted here. They're like, hey, voice chat. Alright, I'll get in voice. All right, I'm in voice now. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Three ninety five to eight ten. Gorgo friggin' slaps, my guy. One sixteen to two eighty four, one sixty six to three eighty four, one twelve to ninety nine. Dang. 
What's better, Gorgo Hera or Gorgo Zeno? I would say Zeno Gorgo is generally better. But I think they're trying to give us a way to kill off whatever troop type you want. And for that, I think the Hera is probably better. Gorgo Hera is looking pretty good, even though you think not to use it. I do, yeah. But remember, Mori's gear is insane. All right, let's look at the other side of the map, see what the heck's going on. Wait, is this the only... This is the only pass that opened where we're having fighting now, isn't it? Like, where are the other pass sevens? So there's this past seven, but it's not a fight. Our allies are building a fort here. This fort still needs to finish. This is honestly like very unprotected? Kind of weird. Ooh. Uh-oh. Hey, yo. Uh-oh. The old sip B fort. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. My bro over here is just trying to get zeroed. Oh, he's bubbled. Okay. Okay. Well, we took this pass. That's how we got in the zone. Okay. Meanwhile, literally no one has taken this pass? That's kind of funny. I guess at some point someone will go back and get the rewards. Okay. I enjoy watching Chiskul more than waiting for Pass 4 to open. I appreciate you, man. We're just chilling, having a good time. Ooh, coordinates. Ooh. Hey. That looks fun. Dude, we must have zeroed so many cities. Oh my god. We must have zeroed so many cities. Dude, they're going for the triple again. All right, chap. Brace for impact. Triple rally incoming.
As they say, chat, GG easy. Two eighty eight to four twenty nine. Seems good, chat. Seems good. We refresh, we get set up to do it again. Territory fights are so much more fun. I generally agree. Yeah, I'm a big fan of the territory fights, truth be told. This KVK is all about fort and pass fighting, which is weird because like the whole point of the KVK is that you can't build forts anywhere you want. But like the whole KVK is fort and pass rallies. I'm probably dropping an elimination rank. I have to be, right? Yeah. That Gorgo Hera is wrecking. Yeah. It is. Is Gorgo good for city defense? Um, I mean, I would use her for city defense. I would use her for that. Henry is a pretty good anti-swarm, actually. Henry can be a little tough to hit. How long do I have on this rune? 18 minutes? All right. Let's refresh those troops, chat. Would you think you want to swarm the Henry instead of the Tadek Ibn Ziyad? No, Tadek Ibn Ziyad has no defensive capability. That's what you want to swarm. Henry reduces skill damage. He boosts his normal attack, I think. Henry is not the first thing you swarm. 11 more weeks of Gorgo meta. Let's go. Yeah, we got some time with it. That's for sure. In KVK2, you can't get Liucha. Yeah, you need Liucha in KVK3 at the earliest, is when you can get him. Dude, look at where I'm clicking. Okay, there we go. Look at where I click and where my pointer went. What the heck? So weird. Huh. Let's see what we got here. Ooh. Man, it's gonna get spicy in this zone, that's for sure. I never thought she would be a good commander, both in OP and garrison. Open field, you mean, maybe? But here we are.
Are they rallying this again? They're doing it again. Hey, yo, bless their hearts. Do I have a Discord? Discord.gg slash Chiskool, yeah. Join my Discord server. Kingsland's on Tuesday. That should be fun. Kingsland on Tuesday, chat. You looking forward to it? I'm hyped. It's so soon. Xeno in the pass? Uh, this is probably just a placeholder. You got your Kingsland tomorrow? Let's go. What do you recommend as an infantry KVK2 march? Probably like Pyrrhus with Sun Tzu. Pyrrhus with Alex would be better, probably. Alex with Esong? That's true. That's classic and good. Martel Sun Tzu would be fine for KVK2. Not amazing. Richard and Charles, I really don't like together. It's like, they don't do much. They don't do enough. Any advice for a 50 mil account going into KVK1? Yo. That's a lot of power for KVK1. Have some fun with that. I'll say just don't get zeroed. However safe you think territory is, it probably isn't safe. Huge amounts of territory can change hands overnight. Ooh. Wait a minute. Look at that timing. Uh... I don't think that timing worked out the way they wanted. Dude, this is just Denny and Nevsky is about to pop, bro. GG. My son doesn't believe me. Can you say how much you've spent in game? Sure, Derek. So I've spent like $120,000 in Rise of Kingdoms over the course of the last five years. Now, I'm not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. But I'd recommend prioritizing things like saving for retirement, prioritizing your family, having an emergency fund. On all my accounts. Yeah, this is all my accounts combined. So like $120,000. It's a lot of money. For me, it's all a part of a business expense. 
technically this YouTube channel is a business. And like, you know, when I make content every day, that's not how I think about it. But what I do think about is what is the most entertaining content I can make? Well, typically it's having access to the newest, coolest stuff, right? Is it a tax write-off? Yeah, it is actually. So it's all technically a business expense. That means you still pay for it, but it counts against your income, which is a good thing. I am a full-time content creator, so I do not have another job. One hundred twenty k over five years isn't all that bad. I mean, uh, it's still like twenty four k a year, which like that's a lot of money. Yoda should fund your channel. He already very generously gifts memberships. Big shout out to Yoda eight oh eight. And gives me a bunch of content as well, actually. It's amazing how many people don't understand taxes and retirement and saving. What I would say is amazing is that we don't really teach taxes and retirement and saving in school. That's what I find amazing. Like, why is that not taught in an American education? A standard part of the education that you get should be something about how to save for retirement, right? Like, but it's not. It's called tax evasion. Uh, tax evasion is something different. Chat says, how much do you earn on YouTube monthly and yearly? How much does your job pay you monthly and yearly? That's such a weird question to ask, right? It was a joke? Oh, okay. Rustum, check the pinned uh, chat. How is KVK going in 2605? It's going well. I see your request for the Gorgo Constantine, but I'm going to let my kingdom do their thing. I think the reason they're using Hera is because we need to not kill all our infantry before King's Land. Is Guan Nevsky doing better than Guan Joan? Honestly, it'd be hard to say. I haven't had enough opportunity to fight with it yet. Why are you not streaming the fighting in 2605? There is no fighting in 2605 right now.
Three inf, one archer, one cav, or three cav, one inf, one archer. I think feel like triple cav is kind of strong these days, but I also think triple inf is better than it's been in a long time. Freshly man TV, what's up, dude? I'm gonna grab my hoodie real quick, one sec. Have I seen people using Gorgo Constantine in KVK? I have. I've seen them training positive, yeah. All right, we have our top secret push time listed on the screen. Best accessories for the open field? Ring and horn, for sure. Rings and horns with one dagger, and I still really like one web, but some people would say don't bother with it. Do you ever get tired of standing for hours? Yes, yes I do. Top secret, chat. Our allies are doing really well this KVK. I'm very happy to see that. They were in a little bit of trouble at the start of the KVK, but the middle kingdom joining with the rightmost kingdom really changed the tempo. All right, chat, we're about to do some stuff here. Freshly Man TV, welcome to the Epic Guard, dude. I appreciate you. Let's get those hype emojis for Freshly Man TV. This is the Warriors Unbound KVK. This noob is still VIP 17? That's what I keep saying. How am I in the top 10 for kills just standing around at VIP 17? It's crazy. Oh, the rally's coming too? Awkward.
Hey man, I'm following the marker. The marker says push here now. I feel like I'm the only one doing it. I'm just tanking, but is what it is. All right, I'm definitely just dead here. Freshly Man TV, enjoying some sparkling wine while you exercise for entertainment. Makes me look weak. Keep up the great content. Decided to step away from mobile games due to financial difficulties. Follow his advice, chat. Thank you for the super chat, dude. I do really appreciate it. Gotta take care of the uh, finances first, you know? Let's heal this up. Also, I gotta get a rune. I'm a little afraid to look at these reports. Yeah. 73 to 51. 62 to 114. That's good. 66 to 147. 60 to 111. 69 to 77. Not bad. Not bad. Closest rune, I think, is over here. Okay, let's run it back out, baby. Mountain Man, what's up, dude? Oh, I missed the part where we cleaned them up. What the heck? I have more gems than resources? True. Yo, that feeling when you have more gems than resources. I mean... What am I going to spend them on? More than gems events and... Probably... Hunt for... No, not hunt for history. The egg event? Holy Knight's treasure? The one who burned Raz is here. For the first time you hit 50,000 gems, you feel like a whale. Abdo, check out the pinned comment. You made Raz humble. True. That time you humbled Raz. Okay. Only top 10 in kill elimination chess school? I know.
I am going to die now. This, this is about to get real awkward. I, I don't know why we ran all the way behind the pass. So that's awkward. That's, that sucks. We had a marker that was like, go back a little bit. And then I look away and then it's like, we went back all the way, but nobody said anything in voice. GG. Or I missed it. I might've missed it. Seeing that 1960 KVK and how much KP they got, to, uh, yeah, I mean, turns out that bottomless resources plus endless uptime of your account equals lots of KP. Yeah, Cortex plays. No, Cortex is playing again. I think they're going to try to rally the pass again. Let's get a look. Oh, they're not even rallying the pass. Weird. Oh, man. I mean, the guy's name is Burn Me, so... GG. Do you think new equipment tier upgrade will be better than refining? I don't know. I think both will have a purpose, but the fact that it's taking so long makes me really anxious about what, like what all are they changing? I don't know. Is that Liu Chess Sargon? Yes, it is. That's the combo I said was gonna be very good. And guess what? It's very good. <laughs> What do you think about Liucha Alex and Guan Skippy? I think it's fine, but not amazing. But I think that's probably the right way to do it. I'm running Huo Joan right now just to kind of see how it goes. Next archer might replace Boudica. Um, you would kind of expect that. I mean, if you have one archer march, it's probably Zuge Leong plus whoever the new commander is. Are you for real? I just maxed Boudica. Well, but you probably should be using multiple archers 
Oh, but you use only one archer? Well, I mean, you have until, you know, the next archer shows up. You got at least nine months, right? Maybe six months? Uh, you got a little time. Next Zenith probably is in like the January time frame, like Christmas, end of December into January. Him for field skin? I'm using an infantry skin at the moment. Do you know that Epic Joan has 25% normal attack damage in the fourth skill? Yeah, I mean, as a Bastion skill, it would be really good, or an auxiliary skill would be really good. I mean, it's like 25% all damage for Liu Che. Yeah, that's good. 20 mil is probably not enough power push for a Xena. Chat says next city skin could be universal. Um, typically that is true. Of the Christmas time frame, I think. Chat says next Zenith should be Archer or Leadership. I mean, they could do a Siege Zenith and really throw us for a loop. Right? Like, if you... Well, I don't know why they haven't done a Siege Zenith at this point. Do you think Gorgo Constantine will be viable for a long time? I hope so, but they'll probably counter Gorgo with the next meta. That's what they usually do. They counter whatever we just got. Your kingdom is starting KVK in three days? Cool. Am I planning on making new commander tier lists? Yeah, I probably will. I mean, like, I'm kind of... I, I generally release a new tier list when something is changing or is new or, you know, I've got something different to say. Right now, I don't have anything new to offer from the last time I did an open field tier list. Like, I think my investment tier list in, what was it, October is still 
was it September? When did I do that? I think it's still super relevant. Let's see, when was the last time I did one? Looks like it's been a minute. Yeah, it was September. And like, not a lot has changed. It didn't change in October. And here we are in November. You want a tier list just for garrisons and rallies, though? That's an interesting idea. What's the better pair? Oh no. Dude, dot mode. Why? Okay. Dude, why did the game just zoom in and out? Hello? Dude, my infantry are teleporting. What? My infantry are literally teleporting. Sixty five to one oh eight. Seventy seven to forty eight. Sixty six to one thirteen. 66 to 91, 59 to 86. Yeah, that's okay. We get those helps, we get back to it. Um, can you ping me or DM me just for a question? No, probably not. Um, the reality is that I'm like crazy tapped on time. I'm basically negative time. So if you, your question doesn't get answered in a live stream, I would strongly recommend just posting in the community channels and seeing if other people chime in. And they almost certainly will to steer you in the right direction. But I don't do one-on-one -on -one coaching. For people that are members of my channel, they post in the Epic or 
Legendary or Elite Guard. And those questions I try to get to as fast as I can. What are your PC specs? It shouldn't be this la laggy. I mean, yeah, I have a 2080 Ti graphics card. It, it's a, at this point, it's a three-year-old PC. I'm like, maybe I just nuke the damn thing and buy a new one. But like, it was pretty top of the line when I got it. I mean, I got that graphics card back when a 2080 was a thousand five hundred bucks. Gosh, bless. You have a 3080? Have you updated your bios? Uh, it's been a minute, but I feel like I have certainly within the last year, maybe within the last six months. Okay, here we go. All right, so we swing in here. I don't know what we're doing. Probably burning uh, fort, maybe? Okay, we kind of shove here, and hopefully we burn the fort, I guess. I just kind of assume it needs to get burned.
Uh oh. What alliance is the rally set from? SK? Okay, great. They're kind of pushing this field on the right. All right, chat. Looks like we're moving. All right, looks like we're balling behind the pass. All right, that had to be good trades, 32 to 98, 20 to 70. Nineteen to one thirty, twenty to one thirty six, sixty nine to one oh four. Seems good, chat. Why don't you use Zuge Leong? I am using Zuge Leong. What do you mean? All right, we march home, we regroup, we do it again, chat. This is the way. Guan Nevsky, yeah, check out the pinned chat that I made here. Bro, I'm still number seven. That's hilarious. Dude, I'm the five March wonder. Hey, yo, I'm the five March wonder. After Cod Rock? Uh, I don't think I quite understand that comment. 
Any reports with Attila Liuchad? No, unfortunately none. I could ask. Dude, that would be really crazy, Attila Liucha. I would be really curious to see it. My favorite commander? I mean, Liucha is pretty legit. He is a double attack. What's not to love about that? And he's got a new type of damage. I mean, and he's got instant proc and march speed and AoE. And he's got a debuff. I mean, he basically does everything I want in life. Monster Fort says I need T5 so badly. Yeah, they help. Really expensive to maintain, though, resource-wise, let me tell you. I hope you don't like resources, because... <laughs> There's a lot of resources to maintain them. Domenico, cheers, dude. Anyone with Gorgo Liucha on the field? I don't think so. Dave says I got 36 mil kills in my KVK, used 5 to 6 billion resources total. That sounds very efficient, dude. How many kills am I up to? I feel like I'm not up to that many. I don't know. Am I even at 20? Oh, 27. Oh, I'm up at 27. That's decent. Okay, here we go.
think I can kind of ride this mountain a little bit. I think I'm using this mountain ledge really well right now. Although, I feel like we might just be losing field right now. I don't know. Dude, these guys all the way to the pass? What are they doing? These guys are going to be really interesting to fight in Kingsland. Because their field is good when they're on. But they're going to hit downtime soon, I think. And like, then what happens? <laughs> Dude, this targeting. Oh my god. Hit the enemy. So... Guys on the left are going to be an issue. Like, we need to be shoving right, but those guys on the left need to be addressed. I don't know what the answer is. What I really should do here is refresh. 
I'm missing a march and I'm all yellow and red, but all in all, those have to be some pretty decent trades. That's gotta be pretty good. Okay. Let's look at these reports real quick. Hey, yo, 47 to 232. 39 to 235. Oh my god. 50 to 179. 36 to 237. And then this March tanked. 73 to 79. Not bad. Harold is definitely not better behind Trajan. I've tried it. I know for sure that it's not. Those reports are crazy. Hey, yo. Gorgo or Sargon for Liucha? I mean, I think Sargon is the better open field commander than Gorgo. That's for sure. The troops come home and then we send them back out, chat. That was a great push, though. We didn't actually gain ground, but... I felt like they had good numbers on their defense there. How's it going? It's going pretty good. Um, you know, it's kind of the long, slow grind to take out these forts at this point. You know how it goes. My tech is pretty good. This is where things are going to get really interesting. This is where things get really interesting. It always gets spicy when new kingdoms get in the mix. And I think the question is... Can we... Get these forts for the Kingsland entry or not. Maybe. I think if we get these forts down for this Kingsland entry, that's a huge win for us. You hope they make forts cross crystals? That would uh, certainly change things up. There's like a hundred ways they could address the fort meta. So far, it has not happened. Will Gorgo be targeted in the field? I mean, maybe. Oh, double rally hitting. Hello.
Time to swarm some rallies, baby. Bro, literally, I cannot click. What the heck? It's maybe because the marker was there? I don't know. I'm literally like spamming a right click on that thing. It's not doing anything. I got in like two normal attacks. GG. Yeah, that was a triple rally. They've been doing that. Four fifteen to six twenty five GG. That garrison commander hold on insanity. I mean, like, Gorgo Hera is doing just fine. Is it just me, or did Gorgo just trade positive against a triple? No, I mean, she just traded positive against a triple. For arc? Um, so in arc, you're going to stuff lots of different troops in there. So I would say Gorgo Hera is probably better than Xeno Gorgo and arc. Just because, like, you're going to stuff whatever troops available. That's the reason they're using Hera in this pass right now. It's not because it's better, in my opinion. It's because you could put whatever troop you want. And it's not as good as full infantry, but, like, fine. My friend told me that Season of Conquest barbs are 10 times more rewarding. Can you tell me why and how? Yeah, so you can get materials. And uh, materials are really good, obviously. They give mats higher speed ups and gems, says Pluto. Okay. Oh, I need to make a group here. Good. 100 gems is very rare. Yeah, getting gems is super rare. I agree with that. I have done all my bastions, right? Yes.
Gems is a lie. The drop rate is 0 0.000001. They also cost more AP, which I think is a good thing. It just takes too long to spend your AP in Home Kingdom, that's for sure. Come to 3073. Appreciate the invitation, but no thank you. When is your next fight with your main account? I think it's like the 16th. Uh, I mean, technically we have an altar fight. I just don't know if we're going to have a fight. But like the altar is open soon. I have Kingsland on my restart on Tuesday. On the 16th, past seven opens for the main account. On the 19th, I have Kingsland. So we got a lot going on. Saladin or Alex just entered KVK2. Both are good. Both are very good. Should I upgrade my 4 March or make a 5th March with all purple gear? Ooh. I mean, if you're a fielder, which I assume you are, you probably want to upgrade your March. No, I take it back. Make a 5th. That's what I mean. Probably make a 5th. If you have this speed ups and resources to support that five marches is like your biggest jump in power for sure nino i appreciate it Trajan in my 5 March setup? Yeah, this is my restart account. I don't know what to do about that either. Like... I guess I could just switch. Oh, God. I mean, chat, should I just go... Should I just go 3 in? And just ditch the Trajan? I guess I could do it. Should I just go for more infantry and just say, ah, F the Trajan? I kind of want to test it and see how that goes, actually. Sasuke says, do it. What would, what would I run? I have Liucha, Sargon, Guan, and Jones, so that's easy. But I do like Skippy CJ. Skippy CJ would be pretty good. Right? Like. We could just do it for giggles. 
Uh, I should do this after this fight. Do Skippy Nevsky with the artifact? No, I think that's a bad idea. I think that's a bad idea because I want to uplift the weakest march. And like Guan is the one that needs the support the most, in my opinion. <laughs> oh man dude those rallies just kept melted bro i don't know if i trade well but uh even even all right God, it's so evil. I probably can refresh now. Probably. Do you have William? No, I don't have William. No, I'm going to use CJ. Skippy CJ seems like a fine thing to try, honestly. Let's go check my armament setup. William is still good, yeah. Oh! 454 to 953, chat. Brutal. 219, 326, 128, 183. Uh, it looks like. This is traded positive for them. 81 to 48. They traded positive right up until we swarmed it. And then, oh god, they swarmed the garrison. Whoopsies. Or the AoE got them. But this looks like they swarmed the garrison. Yikes. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Let's try Skippy CJ and see how it does. Um, can I mess with the gear while they're out of my city? I think I can.
This is kind of awkward. Leadership item. Gonna have to do something about that. Oh, that's also leadership. So awkward. But you know, I can do it with the leadership gear, see what happens, and then switch it out. If it's doing fine, and I prefer it. You know? Let's just use it for a minute, see how it does, and then I can make another one chat. Give it a shot. I'll be missing 2% health and 2% defense. Like, we just see how it goes and then decide what to do with it. You're right if you ignore it, Hua William eats. Hua William slaps, man. If that march is allowed to just do whatever it wants, phew. That should give me quest completion. No. Already had it. All right. Your next ring, will you get a special talent? It is guaranteed that I get the special talent with my next ring. That is correct. <laughs> Literally all I have to do is craft it and it's guaranteed. I mean, I guess at some point I should go to six marches. And I'm, like, not far from that point. Except... You know, they got the whole new equipment system. So, we'll see. Where is the new equipment system? Bro. Inquiring minds want to know. That's for sure.
they're Trajan buffing their rallies now. Just a heads up. Yeah, all three of these kind of suck to swarm, I'm not going to lie. Yeah, I think that makes sense then. Tariq Luce in the middle now. Bro, you just pop those rallies. GG, easy. Did you see 200k normal attacks? Probably did, yeah. I mean, A is what it is. It'd be cool to test it and see if you like it more or not. I mean, I think the advantage of the Hera is that you can throw whatever troop type in, you know? See how I did. I think I was getting surrounded, so like I wouldn't expect to do well. <laughs> okay, but I traded super positive anyways. It's actually surprising. I'm like trading even on rallies here. Will the stream be up later? I'll be real, I wasn't expecting to still be streaming, but I'm enjoying what we're doing here. We're just chilling. I'm good with it. As long as y'all are good with it, I'm good with it. It's kind of low-key, not too high energy. I could chill for a bit. What's your rank in the enemy elimination? Six, I'm gaining rank. EO, how am I gaining rank? I'm not even doing anything. Chisco, I love you. I'm your fan. Please bring Pokemon X and Y as gameplay together with Rise of Kingdoms. Um, 
Thank you again, Agnes, for the super chat. I do really appreciate it. I used to play Pokemon Go, but I do not currently play Pokemon Go. I haven't actually played a Pokemon game other than Pokemon Go. How's the main account KVK going? Good, I mean, we're just chilling it right now. Dude, that counter rally. Oh my god. Is that a counter rally? What the? One mil to 1.26. What do I think about SIP? I think it's an extremely organized group here. They do the work, which is great. I think for being an A kingdom, it's in a really great spot. I think there's still things we can work on, of course, but like... It's in a pretty good spot. Are we missing a garrison captain? No. Chat says you guys are getting a lot of T5 deaths. Um, from a kill point standpoint, maybe slightly more. I mean, I wouldn't say a lot though. Twilight Falls good. I'm a new player. First KVK. Was wondering if it's worth grinding for. I mean, if you can get it in your first KVK, it's a nice pickup. I'll point out that the developers are kind of moving away from normal attack. Or, uh, sorry, away from skill damage and into, like, normal attack now. So I don't know if it'll be amazing forever, but... I think it's a nice pickup if you can get it. If not... I think it's fine. You have opportunities to get it later, see? Uh, I'll try that again. Uh, see? Wow, I have 800,000 of this currency, bro. What the heck? Uh, let's just buy all these transmutation stones. You'll get options to get it later. Dude, I have a lot of that.
We're just chilling here. Is Gorgo Hera the meta? I mean, I'd like to see us try some other stuff, honestly. It looks like we're doing... Xeno Hera for now? Constantine is very good, chat says. I've seen some reports of it in passes and it is good, but... Guan Yu and Gorgo a good pair? I don't think so. No, and, and Guan Yu with Liu Che is not a particularly good pair either. Dido Hera versus Gorgo Constantine? I'm not sure which is better. Test Gorgo Constantine in a real life situation like KVK. I mean, I think it'd be cool to use here, but I also feel like saving our infantry for Kingsland is a good idea. I'm very curious as to why kingdoms are not using siege units and range attacks because it's been meta to destroy your siege units for years. So a lot of people don't even have siege. And then of the people that have Siege, the ask is for them to work on a whole new set of Legendary gear and then crit it. I mean, you're talking about like $10,000 worth of materials, right? For something that like, is it good? Is it not good? Is it meta? Is it not meta? Like, that's a pretty tall ask. Twenty four eighty nine downfall went really quick. What do you mean? Isn't twenty four eighty nine chilling right now or no? Gorgo Dido with infantry relic. I mean, that could be a thing. I don't know. Hey, Mori, do you have Dido maxed? Do you have the infantry relic? Is, is Gorgo Dido a thing? The majority of people left 2489? Really? That's news to me.
They're also Trajan buffing, so... All right, time to heal. And I guess we could look at these reports. Although you generally don't expect these to be great given that I'm getting swarmed while doing it. But I traded positive. There's no way that's Boudicca CJ, bro. I think that's Boudicca Zugi Leong maybe. And I'm actually somehow trading positive, wow. Uh, except for Skippy CJ, lol, chat. L O L O L. Nah, 2489 still strong at 2.4 trillion kill points. Yeah, I'd be really surprised if 2489 was actually having a mass exodus. That would really surprise me. What's your enemy elimination ranking? Still six. Too bad there's not a kill event, huh? Seven eighty to eight sixty seven. So you think the Xeno Gorgo didn't do as well? Yeah. I mean, if we have a lot of mixed, especially, like it's gonna be really tricky to figure out. Let's look at Dido. Would that garrison actually be really good here? Two thousand damage factor. Thirty percent skill damage reduction. It'd be infantry defense. It'd be infantry damage to infantry? I think. And you take less normal. This would make the infantry get more attack. Your normal atta attacks have a chance to inflict ambushed. Yeah. Twenty percent health, and you know, reduce skill damage taken. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I know Dido is like really good anti swarm, but I don't know. Let's bring out the marches. Mori, you don't have a crit coin, do you? Do you have a crit coin? Okay. 
Um, because if you're gonna run the Constantine, the coin is pretty good. Right. Oh, that's good. That that'll be good. Um, my main account, we took both zone fives and we're just kind of chilling right now. We're waiting for altars to open, and then after the altars, there's going to be, um, on the 16th, we have a pass opening, and the 19th is King's Land. Ring coin with Constantine? Yeah, that'd be good. Or Greatest Glory. Honestly, I think Greatest Glory in this instance is better, if you're getting surrounded like that. Greatest Glory coin is probably the play. chat we're almost back Is Huo Joan and Nevsky William a good pair? I would think that you'd be better off with Nevsky Joan and Huo William, honestly. I think that's a much better pairing. Nevsky Joan is insane together. Huo Joan can overrage. And you end up slowing yourself by a turn. Henry Justinian, can confirm, is a crazy rally. I have Liu Chao with Sargon. Mike says, I'm in 2489. We're just fine. Sounds like a 2010 troll. Okay. Yeah, I thought 2489 was just fine. I mean, it it would have been news to me. I mean, at this point, when we look at, like, top five kingdoms, wouldn't 2489 be in that list, potentially? 1960, 365, 1093, and who else are in the top five kingdoms in the game?
Were we not targeting Digital's Rally the first time? Ooh. Oh, whoops. Yeah, well, I thought we were going for the Rally, huh? I two for one against it. <laughs> I was the only one swarming the rally and I still two for one it. <laughs> hey yo. The heck? Uh, that's just funny. I was just swarming the rally, like, what? Isn't that what I'm supposed to be doing, huh? Nope, apparently not. Please tell me we have Constantine in here. Let's friggin' go. Mori, you have the Constantine relic, right? I'm going to assume that silence is a good thing. All right, cool. Chat says Henry John. How about Gorgo with Liu Cha? I mean, that's obviously a very good pair. Okay, we roll, baby. I'm definitely curious how this garrison did. Here comes a counter rally, I think. All right, chat, the moment of truth. Oh, it worked. Hey, the Constantine actually worked. Oh my God. 300 to 507, 373 to 353. 118 to 97. Wow. It, chat, it worked. Dang. Well, chat. What's the magic coin? 
Skolas's lucky coin has a 10% chance when you are attacked to give you a shield. The more things that are attacking you, the higher chances for a shield. Now with Constantine, when he gets below 50%, whenever you get a shield, you take 40% less skill damage. And that lasts for the duration of the shield, which is typically three seconds. So Lucky Coin on Constantine ends up being 40% less skill damage taken for three seconds, which is pretty good. Would Flav Gorgo work to avoid her reduction on Flavius's skill damage? Um, maybe, but you really want the Gorgo to be the primary anyways. For the 900 rage cost on the active skill. I think we're just chilling now. We're mostly just chilling, chat. I know we're like staring at the screen here, waiting for rallies, but that's what we're doing. <laughs> staring at the screen, waiting for the triple. We're just waiting on them triples. I mean, when these forts burn out, theoretically, we start to get some progress over here. So, I don't know how long this is going to last. If, if we get control of this in the next 24 hours and start building over this way. Like, I, I think if we have four passes into Kingsland, we are locked as a victor for sure. It, it, would, it feels like it'd be very hard for us to lose with four passes into Kingsland. That is my assumption. Test Gorgo Constantine? Oh, we literally just did that. How did you guys feel about the Gorgo Constantine? Good enough to do it again? Okay. I mean, I think the key is that, like, the more ways you have to get shields, the better. What accessories are you using? I would assume that, like, in this instance, a greatest glory plus, ideally, a coin would be the best.
All right, let's see how we did, chat. Ooh. <laughs> Whoa, Joan. It's not doing bad, I'll tell you that much. 28 to 61. This is my March that got swarmed. I still did 31 to 40. 25 to 40. 16 to 32. 10 to 36. GG. I mean... Chiss is at it again. <laughs> easy, baby, easy. They rally, we swarm. Where they rally, we swarm. Alright. Okay. This is how you know we're we're on the grind. I got too many things I have to do all at once, chat. Just is what it is. Chat says, I think defending is just OP right now. Constantine is revived with Gorgo. What a very strong duo. I love it. It's actually really crazy, isn't it? 93 is not an Imperium anymore. They're probably dropping right now for migration, if I had to guess. That's got to be what they're up to. November 11th is more than gems? Is it? You think a week from now? I feel like it's been about a month. I feel like we are due for a more than gems. Do you remember when we used to get more than gems only like once a quarter? Am I misremembering or did it used to be less frequent? I don't know what's in the next egg. But I think egg is absolutely worth maxing. It's so good. Certainly you should always crack egg to 10, right? And get the tiered reward for 10. Even if you don't think you need it, like, to 10 is really good.
check the Constantine report? Oh, yeah. What's happening with equipment? Any news? No news. We're just chilling, chat. I'm just hoarding materials at the moment. <laughs> A little late for that, boys. <laughs> <laughs> Six thirty seven to eight thirteen. Two eight two eighty four to four seventy three. Yikes. Three fifteen to three oh two. 37 to 36. Uh, this is fun, chat. I'm having a good time. So chat, you may be wondering like what's going on with the pass here. So we already zeroed all the cities that we can zero, I think. And um, at the end of the day, we can take triple rallies on the pass or we can take single rallies on our forts. So like, good luck. Let them try to rally our forts is the idea, right? Just let, let's see them rally our forts and see how that goes, you know? I doubt the enemy elimination has changed too much. I mean, I should be going down in rank, but I'm going up in rank. How am I fifth, bro? I'm not even doing anything. Why am I not sitting? Because uh, I won't take this matter sitting down. <laughs> Got him! <laughs> oh my god. Oh no. Oh, they're doubling themselves. Oh no. Oh my god. I can't believe that worked. Bro, we even had the markers on the stream that we were giving up the pass and they still got themselves like that. Oh my god. Yo, that gives new meaning to friendly fire. OMG.
We're giving up the pass because we could either take triple rallies on the pass or single rallies on the forts. So, like, why are we taking triples on the pass? We already zeroed all their players. We don't have the field to go take their forts. So let's just take the singles on our forts and call it a day. Does that make sense, chat? Right? Like, why take triples on the pass when we could just take singles on the forts? The only reason we did triples for as long as we did is because we were still zeroing cities. So after we zeroed the cities, like, what? A, why are we doing this? Lots are sleeping there. Oh, yeah, dude. So many AFKs in every pass fight. That just is what it is. Time to go to Valhalla to chat. Here we go. Oh, I'm just dead. At this point, I am just dead. Hope I have some counter attack. <laughs> I am, I am dead ski. Oh yeah. All right, heal hospital. Rise of dots. Those reports have to be bad. Oh, yeah. 71 to 64. 61 to 33. Oh, we should not look at these reports. Oh, 59 to 78. Oh, 67 to 62. That's not terrible. This one's got to be terrible. 65 to 49. Yeah, that's, that's not great. All right. Good news, bad news. Good news is it's time to defend the forts. Bad news is I got to go help get dinner ready. So if you enjoyed the live stream, do me a favor, throw a like on here, consider subscribing. I'll be back tomorrow with a sponsored vid. I'm really hyped about it. And Monday, I'll have another probably Rise of Kingdoms vid. Tuesday, we'll be streaming Kingsland, so you're not going to want to miss it, all right? Until next time, my friends, you have fun smashing the kingdom. Thank you for joining into the stream. I appreciate y'all. Take care, everybody.